on to the Dominican Republic, man. Have you ever been to the DR, man? Hell no. Oh man. Yeah. <laughs> I don't go. I don't go to poor islands. <laughs> I'm joking, y'all. <laughs> Now, you know, like any vacation that I could afford, I don't want to go on. You know what I'm saying? And they got a lot of good packages down there. I like to stick to Jamaica. You know, Jamaica, you, you got to come off like at least two racks to really have a good time. You know what I'm saying? You know, um, that I, I used to, yo, know, tell, tell them what happened in Dr. Demand Republic, man. Listen, I think they got a serial killer going down the Dominican Republic. <laughs> <laughs> you know, in the last. Um, I don't know how many, it's been a couple of years it's been happening. People go on a particular uh, resort in the DR and all of a sudden they end up sick. They got fluid in their lungs. They end up dying, you know? And uh, now I, I did read something. I was watching the local news and two or three local people that went to the DR said they got sick, the same symptoms that these people, this has been like six, seven people so far, you know? And, um, I did see a local news say um, the when the one people came home, they went to the doctor. They said it it's kind of looks like when you get exposed to a pesticide, something like that. And the people that were there, they said they were spraying some pesticide out there. So that could be it. It might not be a, a serial killer. It might be, pest, but it might be a serial killer using pesticide. You never know. You know they're slick, but it's people are getting killed now in DR and. I don't know. The shine is saying they ain't going to DR. Then they say, well, you live in Chicago, so what are you scared of? <laughs> I'm like, I can't even believe we're having this conversation. <laughs> I swear to God, man. They were like, you live in the hood. You scared to go to the DR? <laughs> I'm like, come on. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yo. I think you could take the hardest gangster out of Chicago and set him in the hardest hood in DR. He ain't lasting but five minutes. Yeah, man. There's same people. People don't know, man. Outside of the United States, man, yo, <laughs> yo, it's real difficult out there, man. They, they think you come on, man. You can just go to Mexico. They, listen, I, people like crave for sport, man. Listen, even that nine-year-old nine pop your ass for a taco, walk right up to your melon, plap. All you gotta do is watch that movie, City of God. Yeah. Yeah, there was. What was the name of that movie you said again? Say, City of God. City of that was, God. Yeah, yeah, I seen that, that. Exactly. Yeah, I was based out of the slums in Brazil. You know where there's no running water, where you got to share a uh, share a fountain. You know everybody go down there and get their water from the local fountain. It's different, different out there. <laughs> yeah, man, it's in the struggle. That's why I can't take people serious. That. Um, Oh, we're oppressed. We're struggling. Yo, you, you Akadas are not struggling with your Gucci, Gucci shoes, your Gucci belts. You got really people out here that got no running water. They got no air, central air. They got no air conditioning. You know, they out there, you know, they don't got any, they probably, some of them don't even got no refrigerator or freezer and stuff like that. You know, and y'all sitting out complaining, man, come on, man. Yo, them, 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 them cats from Chicago was right. They better not set foot in DR. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, they better leave the yard alone, man. <laughs> well, what do you think it is? Is you think it's acting because it's it's not a coincidence now. There, there's actually something going on now. Is it just uh, per chance or something like that, or is it you know something nefarious reason? Is a witch doctor? A witch doctor <laughs> <laughs> mixing up that bruja. <laughs> Oh, you know, man. down in the DR, they do bruja. That's the man. Hispanic magic, black magic. They still whipping Haitians' ass in, in, in DR, man. Oh, yes, they are. <laughs> Jesus, man. Come on, man. Yeah, you caught on the other side after midnight. <laughs> you, get <laughs> you get your ass whooped like your mama when you come home with the right <laughs> You say good night. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I hate I hate that's like like that, but you know it's I don't know. I guess it is what it is for the time being. Hopefully, they can. Uh, you it's know, white power. <laughs> <laughs> but yo, can we discuss our Dominican is black man? Can we discuss that real quick? <laughs> discuss what? Our Dominicans black man? No. They're no, white. you're not black, or no, you're not discussing. No, they're white. 
We're not claiming them. <laughs> you know, I'm sticking with I'm sticking with the people that claim us. Right? If yeah. you're not claiming us and you don't want to be black, good, go. You're white now. You're on the white team. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired. Of, yeah. I'm tired of seeing it because, you know, some Dominicans be like, man, I'm not black. I'm Dominican. You know, I'm right. like, okay, partner. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm all right. Like, all right, man, bet. You know, and then I see that kind of up and arguing with these people up and down. No, you are black. You are black. I'm like, man, why are you trying to force something on somebody they don't want it, nothing to do with, man? Like, God damn, man. There's, <laughs> I mean... <laughs> For every one of them, there's a Rachel Dolas all tying to get into the brother, the black culture. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the history of that island, we have to understand that it was first occupied by a dark, melanated human being. Mm -hmm. And then the Spanish white man came in under the name of Cortez and Cristobal Colon. And they changed the native language to Spanish or Espanol. So what we're talking about here is either these people are going to have to claim the indigenous African native people or they're going to have to claim the white man from whence they get their language from. I say if you don't want to be so-called black, then be white. Right? You get awarded white privilege in these, in these nations. Right? The lighter you are in India, the better off you are. They talk about all the time. You Bollywood, Bollywood ain't got no dark skinned women in Bollywood. It's all light skinned sisters that passing for white. Chinese culture do it too. They paint they they face white during these ceremonies. Don't nobody want to be black. That's cool. If you don't want to be black, go over there with the white folks. We got plenty of white folks that want to be black now. <laughs> I got I seen one earlier. She got she uh took some injections in her body. Her eyes turned brown, her head turned brown. Come on, we got injections for everybody. <laughs> we could play this game all day long. <laughs> um a couple um super chats. Uh Drew Sample, uh thank you for super chat. US old price jumped quite a bit. Um <laughs> Another one from Drew Sample. I heard Big Poppy was banging some gangster's girl. Oh, we got to talk about him. Forgot about him. And James Dietrich. Uh, shout out to James. Uh, people in the U.S. think poverty means you're gonna, you are can't afford unlimited data. They never seen poverty like in South Africa or East Africa, alien to a capitalist. Mm. Exactly right. That's definitely on point. You know, and I'm definitely not going to DR if, if, if their hometown hero What's that? What's that Joker's name? Ortiz. Big Poppy, David yeah. Ortiz. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go to a local bar. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. He 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 out there slinging that D to all everybody, <laughs> banging everybody. He banging some um, drunk a uh, big dope time dope dealers woman. Mm. <laughs> and then he hired some hitters, and, and they damn near took him out of here. Man, what the hell? Is that what happened? Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Listen, his wife was fighting the side chick in the hospital, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so messy. That's <laughs> I swear to God, man. That's like I'm not going to the DR, man. <laughs> that's like shade room meets cartel wars. Like, oh, that's so messy. He messing around with the cartel leader, girl. And you ain't think you was gonna get clapped up. <laughs> yeah, leading women's alone, stick to your wife, you lose your life. <laughs> he better stick his black ass in Boston. <laughs> 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 That's where he went right back to Boston, man. He went, he better not go back to I'm not going back to DR. Man. <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> you can't go home, man. Yeah. You know they go. They just took Nipsey out going being home. Yeah, Sometimes you got me. <laughs> hey man, you going up? You if you go home and being mixy with people that's that's still out there at home. Nah, man, that's a recipe for disaster. At you least be on the right side again. At least be on the right side of history. You yeah. know, 
You know, I at least move a couple of kilos. Like, <laughs> <laughs> 